all right so this means i have to be saying hello to you once again in my last video i talked about how the word yoruba only came around as the name for yoruba in the 1800s but I didn't talk about how it originated in this video i am going to talk about six different theories and arguments to the origin of the name yoruba the jellyba theory you see this river, popularly known as River Ninja, it has many names. One of them, Oya, Oshimiri, Kwara, and so on. These names are given to it by different tribes. The Malinke people would call it Joliba or Jeliba. This theory believes the people who lived in that area called people in the area of Yoruba, Joliba and that it means people who come from the river Ninja and it was gradually corrupted to Yoruba. The Oyo Oba theory Oba of Oyo was so powerful and influential in those days that its people refer to themselves as people of the Oba of Oyo. Oyo Oba, Oyo Oba corrupted over time as Yoruba the Yariba or Shungai theory. It is believed that it came for the first time in a treaty signed by the then Oyo king and the Shungai ruling dynasty when Shungai met a brick wall in their conquest campaigns towards the south. They found Oyos to be smart, which they considered as being devious, and they also knew that we essentially shared the same source with them. Though to them, we were no longer of pure blood, so we had become bastards. This wrong perception bred the word Yariba, from which the word Yoruba came, which is supposed to mean bastard or cunning. The Yarubawa Theory The name Larubawa was first applied to the early Yoruba traders, who used to go and trade in the countries of the Upper Niger, roughly modern day Mali. Most of those early traders were from the early group of settlements in Ife area. The name is said is used in the Upper Niger to refer to all traders who spoke various dialects of what we now call the Yoruba language and who came from the same distant forest homeland in the southeast of the Upper Niger. Later, when the Arab traders began to come south, across the middle niger to trade directly with yoruba people in the ancient settlements of the ife area yoruba people would refer to them as alarubawa or larubawa which means people who call us yarubawa or the ones who say yarubawa it is believed that yarubawa means people who came from distant forests the yoruba theory it is believed that the word yoruba is a corruption of the Phoenician word Europa, which means West in Phoenician, and was used to refer to Europe. But because Europe prospered without submitting to Allah, the word Europa came to mean those who prospered without submitting to Allah in Shanghai. And as time goes on, the Shanghai used the word to refer to Oyo, who were able to build a large empire without submitting to Allah while they gradually corrupted the world to Yoruba. While none of these theories is generally accepted, there is one that is more popular and is the other version of the Shungai Yariba theory, who states that it comes from the word Yariba or Yaribansa, which could mean cunning or something that I am not gonna pronounce. So let me know what you think about these theories. Next time, I'm going to talk about the theories of the origin of the name of Igbo. And please do help me share this video and subscribe to my channel.